All right, guys, so we did the little bit of a pluggy wuggy and a little bit of loosey goosey and. <laughs> guys so right now we're on the way to moose's house currently driving to figure out some stuff on the pcm that i've got car looks good stats look pretty good we're gonna keep going so we're uh on the way down to his house got a little bit of a drive not exactly close, but we're going to figure out some stuff. There's a couple different reasons why we're going to be doing this. So a couple different reasons why we're doing this is uh, the man, the myth, the legend, Lido, is going to be tuning the car. So in order for us to get information for Lido, we need to have a couple different things. A the VIN that's on the ECU, B, the strategy tune, and then C, the tuning device. The tuning device I've already got that's already on the side, it's ready in hand. The other two pieces that I'm missing are obviously the VIN and the strategy. Those two items alone will help me get this tune onto the car, and number one, need pads disabled, so in order to do that, you need either HP tuners or you get a tune that disables pads. Now, what I haven't decided yet is if I'm gonna run catalytic converters or if I'm gonna run an off-road H-pipe, which I have from a previous setup, which is located in one of my videos for a three-valve setup. Um, but I definitely need pads disabled in order to turn the key and turn the motor over. So that's why we're going to Moose. He's got the perfect gear that I need to identify the information on the ECU because he has the harness that will work for this ECU. Now, if some of you don't know, there's a difference between 0506 ECU and harness versus 07 to 09 and that's the ECU and the harness. So the 0506 cars do have some little differentiation but it's enough that I had to get a new harness, a new ECU. So couldn't use what I had and didn't want to spend a lot of time repainting and rewiring the electrical so made it easier on myself and we bought a harness and ECU. All right guys, so we did the little bit of a pluggy wuggy and a little bit of loosey goosey and got the strategy, got the VIN number, which is also important yeah, because plus. need that, that and the device that we're going to be recording with so now we just got to plug his car back together again like humpty dumpty you guys so got the ecu plugged in good to go turn the key on ready to go so while we're here we're going to take a little bit of look see of what his car is looking like so i know what to do for mine so we have the harness which is going to pop in right here like so catch can i gave this to him you know for an exchange of money <laughs> and uh so the harness looks like i have it on correct i'm gonna have to work on the heater core lines and other things i'm gonna have to look into are the battery harness and should be pretty good to go and that's gonna wrap it up for today guys thanks Hey guys, so that's going to wrap it up for this video. we got more videos coming out for this week. If you want to stay up to date, remember to subscribe down below and have a great day. Say bye-bye.